Hello everyone. Today we will talk about specifically on these two question that wind power will be positive and wind power in a circuit will be negative. But before starting this, let's understand the basic concept. That is consumed power and delivered power. There are two type of power exist in a circuit. That is consumed power and delivered power. So whenever the circuit element is consuming power, it will be positive. So here we declare that consumed power in a circuit will always be positive. In contrary, the delivered power by any circuit element will always be negative. So this is the basic concept that is consumed power and delivered power. I repeat that consumed power will always be positive and delivered power by the circuit element will be negative. So whenever we talk about consumed power, it means that the circuit element is behaving like a resistor, like it is consuming a power. So therefore, in this case, the current will be positive. But now question arises that why the delivered power is negative. So here we can assume that a circuit element like resistor can't supply power to the circuit. It always consumes the power. So therefore, whenever we talk about delivered power by the circuit element, we will assume it to be negative. But now let me tell you about another and an important and the basic and the fundamental concept. That is adhere to passive sign convention. Consider the circuit element here is the positive terminal and this is the negative terminal and the current enter into positive terminal and leaving the circuit at negative terminal so here the current direction look like this this is basically the case which is referred to adhere to passive sign convention and in this case the current will always be positive. Remember that whenever this is the case of adhere to passive sign convention the current over here will be positive. But in contrary to that there is another possibility that is current enter in the negative terminal just like this and leaving at the positive terminal so the current here we will take the direction is negative this is quite contradicted to this one and this circuit you can see the current is positive but here you can see the current and the circuit element is negative and this we usually refer to as do not adhere to passive sign convention. But now question arises that sometime power gets to positive and sometime power as negative. As I have told you earlier that consumed power will always be positive and delivered power will always be negative. But this is not the case always exist in the circuit element. Because sometime you encounter this type of circuit element in which current flows from positive to negative terminal and sometime you encounter the circuit element in which current flow from negative to 
positive terminal and sometimes you may also encounter the power that is consumed power and it is delivered power so there are four different possibilities now we will explain one by one in a detail and a sequence so the first is supplied power this we can also write just like delivered power so as i have told you that supplied power in a circuit will always be negative so we will assume the direction of a current to be negative one so now it is possible that a circuit element may have active sign convention or do not adhere to uh, sorry passive uh, or it may have a passive sign convention as well so first consider here is adhere to passive sign convention so in it and adhere to passive sign convention current flow from positive terminal to negative terminal and this is the case where current gets to positive so power here will be according to the formula p is equal to i times v so you can see current over here in this circuit element that is a and circuit element a current is positive so here power will ultimately be positive because the current is positive but i have told you that whenever we encounter the source our element that is delivering power will be negative so because of this concept this power will gets to negative so this is case number first for delivered power and adhere to active or passive sign convention now we will assume the another case and this case is do not adhere to passive sign convention and supplied power consider the circuit element in which current flow from negative terminal to positive terminal and the current over here will be negative because it do not adhere to a passive sign convention so therefore we will take the direction of current negative so now let's calculate power since power is i times v but this is delivered power or supplied power so i will put over here a negative sign because it is a delivered power and also the current is negative because it do not adhere to passive sign convention so current over here is also negative and multiply by voltage so power over here will be positive so this is our power i repeat this is supplied power and the first case is about adhere to passive sign convention and the second case is about do not adhere to passive sign convention or delivered power so now we will talk about another type of power dissipation in a circuit that is consumed power consumed power is also sometimes called dissipated power and consumed power in a circuit will always be positive now let's look at the two different cases this is adhere to passive sign convention and do not adhere to passive sign convention so first case is adhere to passive sign convention here you can see and adhere to passive sign convention current always flow from positive to negative where current is positive so also it is consumed power for consumed power we can calculate our power is i times v since it is consumed power so therefore i put over here 
पॉजिटिव एंड द करंट इज ऑल्सो पॉजिटिव बिकॉज इट इज एडहेयर टू पेसिव साइन कन्वेंशन सो द पावर और हेयर विल बी पॉजिटिव बट एंड कंट्रेरी टू दैट वेन वी लुक एट do not the case that is do not adhere to passive sign convention that is current flow from negative to positive which is do not adhere to passive sign convention and current in this case always be negative so let's calculate power power is consumed power so here i will left as it is i mean that power here will be positive but the current is do not adhere to passive sign convention which is negative i times v so power or here will be negative i times v so this was this was all about active and passive sign convention that and when power will be positive and when power will be negative hope now it's clear to you for any queries and question you can ask in the comment section thank you